as an athlete, you just have to work hard, and I work hard what I do, and concentrate on yourself. And you know, you're not in control what happens. You know, you're not responsible for all the athletes. You know, there's so many athletes here, and as long as we work hard what we do, and, and for me, enjoy it. That's that's the most important thing. Well, it is under risk because um, you know fans are having and um, trust in us athletes, and if we have to do something like that, or someone have to give us the drugs and later on come to, to be found that uh, we are violating the rules. We are even spoiling um, uh, the trust that the fans have, have for athlete, athletes and also for the sport itself. I really would like to stay completely as far away from that as possible. Um, yeah, I have no comments. <laughs> well, I don't think any sport tests for steroids as much as track and field. So, of course, the numbers of positive tests would be greater than other sports. So, if other sports would test, I think it would be the same or worse where they have positive tests in their, in their sports. Yeah, we're not, I mean, like as, you know, you know, like we're not as big as NBA or the NFL. So, I mean, for us to get exposure, you know, you know, it's very hard, you know. I mean, people really want to watch this um, like during the Olympic Games. So, I mean, with this coming out, it's just, or it's just, you, you, or it's kind of taking the fans away, you know. I, I mean, that's what I believe. I think that this should frighten people that are on drugs. I race clean. Every single race of my life has been clean. And so I hope that if any of my competition is dirty, that they're frightened now that they could get caught too. So I hope this just helps improve and clean up the sport.